Hello everybody. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Today I'm going to be covering the new Hunter's Lodge that you get at level 95 on the scoreboard. And I just want to say you do have to have Fallout first to get this reward. And I just want to say it is actually pretty amazing. I'm very happy with it. And there's more than enough room in here. And yeah, let's get into it here. I'm going to give you a quick little view of it. So, like, I just put together a quick house here, so I'm hopefully good. I might even be moving locations because I'm not sure if I like this location, but that's besides the point. As you can see, it looks great. Like, it's more than big enough, and I found that it didn't take up too much of the camp budget, so you, you kind of got, like, a win-win there. Um, it's just a little compact inside, like most of the prefabs are, but it's still wonderful, and I think it looks absolutely amazing. Lots of porch space. Um, upstairs and downstairs, there's basically like a little balcony, which is where I put most of my stuff. Um, I found there's a nice little hidden spot here, kind of, that you can uh, put your shelter if you like. And yeah, let's head up up here. So the floors are actually really nice, because I haven't seen any floors in the game that you can buy or obtain that look like that, so that's kind of nice. And like I said, a lot of the room for this, you know, is porch room, so you're going to put a lot of stuff out, out on the porch. Um, you can fit all your crafting stuff in here as well. I kind of wanted to have a living room, so that's what I kind of did. And, you know, I wanted a place to sleep, so that's what I did upstairs. But you can very easily fit all your crafting stuff in here, and you can build around it, of course, as well. Um... You know, whatever you want to put in here, the sky's the limit. As you can see, it's, you know, pretty big. And, uh, yeah, it looks great, I think. And once again, like I said, there's lots of balcony space for you to put all of your crafting if you would like. That's what I did. I just found it just fit out here a little bit better rather than trying to cramp it inside the house. I even could have put it in my little shed there. Um, I did want it to say, too, I wish you could see through the windows a little bit better. You have to go, like, really close to them to see through them very well. Which, you know, is not too great, but I'm not going to complain. This is absolutely fabulous, I think, so... Picked a great spot here to build it. Now, these stairs at the back, if you're going to build a cliffside like I did, just keep in mind that you're going to have, like, walk the plank back here if you don't build a little, um, like area for you to walk on to. <laughs> um, if you don't have like, or if you don't build on the side of a cliff, then you won't have that problem. It should just go down into the dirt, I would assume. And yeah, I built another little shed like over here where I could just, you know, have the lead deposit in my power generator. So like I said, you can build around it as well. It's just a little bit tricky. Definitely, you know, some merging will uh, help you. <laughs> um, I'm not too great at merging myself. I just do what I can. Um, another thing that I didn't like too much about it is I wish we could have put the fireplace that we get from the score as well in it. You can see it like kind of just wants to fit in there perfect. And even the design is the exact same as the walls on here. I wish we could have just found a way to fit this in here. Maybe there's some mergers out there. You could let me know a way to get that in there. I would love to know how, but I would probably have to start over. But yeah, that's pretty much it, everybody. Uh, the Hunter's Lodge here, and um, I think it's absolutely great. Um, you can see all the stuff I put down, and like I'm still barely over half a camp budget. So it will save you some camp budget, I think, rather than just building a house. Um, I could be wrong. Maybe it takes up more, but it, it really doesn't seem to. And yeah, if you can get this, I highly recommend building a camp with it if you can. It was actually pretty cool to do. And uh, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Let me know what you think in the comments, and have a great day. Thank you so much for watching again.